What's up, party people? It's your boy, Kenneth G, coming to you with another episode of Undertale. Uh, it's episode 5, I think? 4 or 5? I'll figure it out. It's 5. I'm sure now. I really am. I don't know. But we left off at a point in the last video where there was a mystery we were fighting. It's Sans. We're going to fight Sans. So let's get into it. We're not, we're not going to actually fight Sans, but... We're encountering Sans, <laughs> and it's going to be fun. All right, so let's just get back there, because uh, I had, you know, some record, some uh, video recording issues, so I couldn't get back. Uh, I actually already did this, but I didn't, the recording messed up, so I couldn't. So we're going to start it right off the top, right here. And, uh, it's gonna be fun. My nose isn't stuffy quite yet. I know as soon as I start doing his voice, it's gonna happen. I apologize beforehand. <laughs> it's gonna be fun, though. Look at him. Human! Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like... The joy of finding another pasta lover. Admiration for another's puzzle-solving skills. The desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you're feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. No! Hold on, guys. Sorry. I dropped some things. <laughs> Immersion break. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not. You shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You're a human. I must capture you. Then, I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. The newest member of the Royal Guard. Uh-oh, here it goes. Papyrus blocks the way. I'm gonna flirt with him. What? F flirting So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. <laughs> I can make spaghetti. <laughs> oh no, you're meeting all my standards. I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Let's date later, after I capture you. I'm flying. Why am I flying? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Papyrus, flirt! Oh no! Let's date later! After I capture you! Good, great attack, Papyrus, great attack. Papyrus is thinking about what to cook for his date. You flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. Let's date late. Okay. Okay. I gotta do something else, apparently. Because this won't cut it. Alright. Spare him. So you won't fight? Then let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. I just stand here. All you gotta do is stand still. And blue attacks don't hurt you, so... What's the de- Whoa! You're blue now! Oh shit! That's my attack! <laughs> oh man. No, I don't float now, I gotta jump. You're blue now. Still sparing you! <laughs> I wonder what I should wear. I gotta jump! Jumpy! Jumpy! Papyrus damn empty tea brand fishy cream behind his ear. Fair. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. 
Jump! Jump! Up you go! Up you go! I gotta start backing up now, cause uh, I gotta jump higher! <laughs> That's a little more difficult than you think. Dad's MTT brand anime powder behind his ear. There's a lot of things going behind your ear, brother. <laughs> yeah! Don't make me use my special attack! Yeah! Whoa! No! No! Oh, man! <laughs> Fire MTT brand cute juice behind it. Man, you're gonna have some kind of fungus growing behind there of all the cake layers of things you're putting behind your ear papyrus. If you even have ears, I don't know. I can almost taste my future popularity. Hi! <laughs> Hello! Once again, stop! Emma time! Oh shit! Fire brand Traction slide behind his ear. Wow. <laughs> the pirate head of the royal god. Well, I gotta go through stuff. Big jump. Woo! The pirate cat's MTT band. Beauty yogurt behind it. Yogurt? Ew. Bad. Pirate untethered out. Spaghetti. Whoa. Whoa. Blue. Ah ha ha. Oh! Wow. Mars realizes he doesn't have ears. <laughs> this is great. I see, I told it. I knew it! Can't fool me, Papyrus! Spam. Undyne will be really proud of me. Oh, I gotta, I gotta charge up for this jump! Back up. Jump! Back up. Jump! Woo! Almost. Yeah! Woo! The Pirates is praying a bone attack. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. Oh! oh, oh. I jumped way too early for that last one. The Pirates is considering his, considering his option. I'm just gonna spare you, brother. My brother will well. He won't change very much. Whoa! Oh, I jumped too high! Hard! Smells like bones. I'm gonna use an item. A bandage. Don't gotta go here. I have lots of admirers, but... Whoa. 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 Yeah. Whee. It's like a roller coaster ride. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Pyrus is rattling his bones. <laughs> no, no item. Mercy. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? I don't know. I, I'm sure they will, Pirate. But I uh, can't attack them. I don't think that'll work. <laughs> it's moving! It's moving! Oh, I can't believe I dodged all that. Wow. The Pirate's rattling his bones once again. Someone like you is really rare. Whoa! Oh, I was not ready for that. <laughs> Oh man! <laughs> Smells like bones. And dating me might be kind of hard. Woo! Woo! Ah! Ah, you gotta do small jumps! <laughs> Bone attack again! Ah. After your capture sent away. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> the pirate's trying hard to play it cool. I need to use another item. Uh, Cinnabon. Maxed out, baby. Maxed out. Ugh, who cares? Give up. Whoa, buddy. What the heck? Uh, yeeps. Woo, I caught through it. The pirate prepares a non-bone attack to spend a minute fixing his mistake. Uh, give up, or face my special attack. What's that? What's your special attack, man? <laughs> the pirate's trying hard to play it cool. Yeah, very soon I'll use my special attack. My nose is getting stuffy. 
bone rattlers going on. Uh oh, you better watch out! Not too long, and I will use that special attack. Okay. Yeesh! Oh. Whoa! Ooh, I made that. Whoop. Bone attack, baby, bone attack. This is your last chance before my special attack. Oh. Wee! The power's just cackling. <laughs> Behold, my special attack. Uh. What the heck? <laughs> That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that phone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here. My special attack. <laughs> Triple dot. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Heart's getting ready for a regular attack. Okay. Bear. <sighs> Here's an absolutely normal attack. Okay. Whoa! Oh man! 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 Uh. No! Ah! Whoa! Whoa, dude! Cool, dude. Is what it said. That was cool. Oh man! No. Oh, I just keep going up. <laughs> I'm flying! Oh, it's a good thing I kept descending. <laughs> Big ass bone threw at my face. Look at this! Look at this! Huh? 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 What? 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 Huh? Oh, I got you! Oh, what? 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 My blue heart too much for you? Well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the Great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. No, I'll spare you. Now, your chance to accept my mercy. I've been sparing you the whole time, Papyrus. <laughs> no! <laughs> I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's gonna be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard. And... My friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowie, we haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles, then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal for trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass. Through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is... Well... He's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer. Can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> he walks off crooked. <laughs> That was fun. <laughs> and unexpected, honestly, at first. So what's up ahead? Uh, is this a good or bad thing? I don't know. 
Hello? I know this dude throwing those ice blocks in the ripper. Ah! Save point! Good old sand! The sound of rushing water fills you with determination. Of course it does! Save! Alright. Who's this dude? This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Yep, saying the same thing. <laughs> Yo! Are you sneaking out? Out to see her too? Awesome! She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here, huh? I won't, bruh. I won't. I promise. <laughs> what? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? <laughs> Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. I'm going to Grill Beast. Wanna come? Hell yeah, brother! Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from work. <laughs> Okay, let's go. Over here, I know a shortcut. Okay. Groby's is the other way, but apparently it's a shortcut. For a shortcut, huh? Hey, everyone! Hey, Sans! Hi, Sans! Oh, that's other people. Greetings, Sans! Hi, Sansy! Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Ha, poops. <laughs> here, good comfort. Oh, great. <laughs> Another whoopee cushion. <laughs> Whoops, watch where you sit down. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seat. Anyway, let's order. What do you want? I'll take a burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Grab it. We'll have a double order of burg. <laughs> Scratching his head. What are you thinking of there, Sam? No, what do you think? My brother. He's cool, man. Of course he's cool. He'd be cool, too, if he wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. <laughs> Give me that burger. Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? Yeah. Bon appetit. You tip the ketchup. The cat falls off. And all the ketchup in your bottle pours onto your food. Thanks a lot, Sam. You're a freaking pal. <laughs> Always pulling jokes. Whoops. Ah, uh, forget about it. You have, you can have mine. I'm not hungry anywhere. Thanks, buddy. Scratching your ass. I don't know if I want your burger now. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree. Papyrus tries really hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the royal god. One day. He went to the house of the head of the royal guard and begged her to let him in. It. <laughs> of course, she shut the door in on him because it was midnight. But the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's uh, still a work of progress. <laughs> Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Oh, spotlight. Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yes. So you know all about it. The echo flower. They're all over the marsh. You say something to them, and they'll repeat it over and over. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whisper things to him. Flattery, advice, encouragement, predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flower to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Of course I'll keep an eye out, Sans. That's what I do. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. 
Yeah. I really pulled your leg, buddy. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? <laughs> no! Just kidding. Really, put it on my tab. Great tablature. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. Oh, thanks. Keep me in anticipation, Sans. Way to go. Can I eat the burger? What's up? Did you leave my freaking burger there? Ah! I already talked to these people before. Alright. Oh, yeah. It's saying the same stuff, man. Skeletal telling a fish lady about it, man. That's politics, baby. That's what it is. So, I'm all the way back here. Where do I go now? <sighs> oh, it's Sans. We gotta go on a date, I guess. <laughs> well, hopefully this date doesn't last too long. We'll see what's up. So you came back to have that date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Okay, let's go, buddy! I'm not in control. You're controlling me super fast, peace. Blah, blah, blah. Whoa, what's... Whoa, whoa. Hey, where are you taking me? <laughs> My house. Great. Thanks for the little detour for absolutely nothing. <laughs> let's get some exercise. You gotta get some exercise when you're living underground, you know? You gotta be messing around. You get all froze up and whatnot. Welcome to this... To scenic my house. Enjoy and take your time. Okay. <laughs> the door is locked. I'm assuming you got Sans room. Uh, let's go down here first. Oh! Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. <laughs> what, you like watching the lines on the freaking <laughs> Kitchen! Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please, pursue my culinary art show. Half of the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. <laughs> the other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. Great food museum. It's great. I love it. Iris, you're a connoisseur of everything good in this world. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. <laughs> Dog! It's there! <laughs> what? It's like his arch enemy. Catch that meddling canine! Ah! Curses! <laughs> Sans! Sans! Stop plaguing my life with that incidental music! <laughs> Enjoy and take your time! Alright, let's go up. What's this, spaghetti? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. That's the rock is covered in sprinkles. Great! Great! Feeding job, buddy. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside, yes! <laughs> What's up? What's in here? Nothing? There are no skeletons inside my closet. Except me sometimes. <laughs> sure, let's look in the closet. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Okay, outstanding. That's that's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I will cruise while that's news. <laughs> the, the internet, I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follower count. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. 
<laughs> hey! Those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday. Even though it was basically just happened. <laughs> ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. <laughs> so, um, if you've seen everything, you want to start the date? Begin the date, yes. Okay, dating start. What is this? Dating start. Here we are on a date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry. You can spell prepared without several letters for my name. I snagged an official dating robot from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. Press C key on your keyboard for dating HUD. Oh wow! This is technical. Wowie, I feel so informed. I think we're ready for step two. Step two. Ask for them on a date. Aha! Human! I, the great papyrus, will go on a date with you. Yes. R really? Wowie! I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three. Put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait just a second. Wear clothing? That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No! Could it be? You wanted to date me from the very beginning? Yes, Papyrus, yes. I have. You figured me out. I swooned for you so deeply. You planned it all. You're way better at dating than I am. No! Your dating power! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Don't think you've busted me yet. I, the great papyrus, have never been beaten at dating. And I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes. Just in case someone happens to ask me on a date. Behold! Ha! <laughs> cool, dude! <laughs> yeah! What do you think of my secret style? Love it, baby! Love it! No! A genuine compliment! Date power increased to the... Almost max! However... You don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said isn't valid. This date won't escalate any further, unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. I bet I know what it is. The hat. My hat? My hat! My hat! Yeah! Well then, you found my secret. <laughs> I suppose I have no choice. This, it's a present. A present. J just for you. Open it. You know what it is? is? Of course! Spaghetti! That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right! But oh so wrong. This ain't no plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti find the age in an oaken cask. And cooked by me. Master Chef Papyrus! Human! It's time to end this! There's no way this could go any farther. Eat it! Take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up! The taste is so indescribable! What a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking! And by extension, me! Maybe even more than I do! Oh. Uh. It's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. 
human. I want you to be happy too. It's time to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papinus. I. Uh, boy, it's hot here. Or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I... I'm sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, that I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then, on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I'd be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great Papias, have failed. I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me. A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No! Wait, that's wrong. I can't feel it anything. Yeah, man! I'll help you through these trying times. I'll keep you being your cool friend. And act like this all never happened. After all, you are very great. I'd be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. And hey, someday you'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. But I'll help you set it for a second best. Yeah! Oh god, my nose is so stuffed. Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. Platonically. Well, you gotta go. Yeah! Well, that was interesting. <laughs> Alright, my party peeps. We're gonna leave this episode here in Papyrus's house, in Santa's house. And I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I love getting a stuffy nose doing Papyrus's voice. But it's all for you and my enjoyment, and I love doing it. So if you like this episode, make sure you headbutt that like button. Grab a hubby, subscribe for him, and subscribe for yourself. Follow me on Twitter. The link is always in the description. And I want to thank you for diving through those internet cables to see me, Kid FG. Peace out, y'all. <laughs> That hip boy belongs to you. It does, bitch. <laughs>